So next time I'm talking about this, which is a brush set from a company called Brushine. Brushine, maybe? Um, and it is the uh, makeup brush set is what it's called. So it's a five piece brush set. It includes a powder brush, a foundation brush, a blending brush, an eyeshadow brush, and a crease brush. Um, so all of the brushes come in a sleek white carrying case that makes it perfect for travel, which is this. And this is like the best part of this product to me is this case that it comes in. So it's like the cylinder case and it, it it's not leather, but it's like a leathery um, fabric. And then you take the cap off and then this is where you keep the brushes. So you could just use this like on your vanity as an everyday thing and just put all your brushes in here. I already have a little cute holder. So this I would just use for traveling, but I'm so excited to start using this and putting my brushes in it when I travel because my brushes get so messed up. Whenever I go anywhere, I have to pack them. They get all the you know, folded and the uh, hairs of the brush get all messed up and it's just a whole big thing. So this is going to keep my brushes safe and it just feels really like nice quality and I just love it. So comes in this little case and then the brushes are inside. So all of the brushes are made with a luxurious, soft and smooth synthetic hair. And that's true because when I felt these, I was like, oh my God, these are so soft, all of them. And so I can show you, um, each of the brushes, but, um, the, all the brushes have this like mahogany wood handle. And I think that is, they like are prettier than all of my other brushes. So I'm loving this. Um, so I'll go through and show you what brushes come in this. So first you have this one, which I'm assuming is the powder brush. And I'm not a makeup guru, so I don't, I don't really know what I'm talking about that much. I just do my makeup every day. So I'm going to assume that that's the powder brush. Looks like this. And then, and each of the brushes has like this kind of curved bottom, which I like. Um, and then this one I'm going to assume is the foundation brush because it's a little more like, um, there's like more, it's more dense is what I'm trying to say. The hair is more dense on this. So this one is the foundation brush. I use a beauty blender to put on my foundation. Um, so I'm going to have to find another use for this, but I'm thinking, cause I also like to use dense brushes for my contour and I use cream contour. So this will probably work for that. Um, this brush, I'm going to assume this is the blending brush. So this is probably good for a highlighter. If you use like a powder highlighter, that would probably be really good for that. And then this, I'm going to assume is the eyeshadow brush. So it's like a thinner, as you can see, this is it from the side, thinner, um, kind of like a packing brush for if you were packing um, eyeshadow on the lid. And then the last brush is this one. And I'm going to assume this is the crease brush. It's not as dense as the other eyeshadow brush that I just showed. This one's more dense. This one is less dense, which makes it good for blending in the crease. So I'm going to use this one to do my eyeshadow, which again, I'm not a beauty guru. So this is just me putting on my makeup. Um, so I'm going to go into some brown shades in my little peach palette and just I just take a couple at a time and just kind of like go all over my eyelid and my crease. There's not much technique to what I'm doing. I'm just literally putting it everywhere. So it's not going to look amazing, but I just 
do it to get color onto my eyes. So first I just went in with like the lighter colors and now I'm going in with more of the darker colors. Blending this in. And it doesn't have to be perfect because I'm going to put mascara on and that's going to cover my eyes, my eyelids. It's always weird doing these like makeup get ready with me ones because especially when I do the mascara, like I cannot speak and do mascara at the same time. So it's just kind of like silent, a little awkward. There was a way to put like music on the lives. Maybe I should have done that. So it's not silent while I'm doing some of these things. But yeah, I'm just, I, I, there's no process to what I'm doing right now. I'm literally just putting this brush into various brown shades and just putting it on my eye and blending it. So I also, like, I feel like I'm just going to take this bigger brush, this blending brush, that's probably for highlight, and I'm just going to put it in the lightest brown shade and literally just rub this huge brush over my eye. Because I feel like it. Also, I make weird faces when I put on makeup and it's going to get weirder when I do my mascara. So be prepared. All right, yeah, that looks good to me. <laughs> I literally just wanted to put brown eyeshadow all across my lid. Um, but then I'm gonna go under my lash line. I'm gonna take this brush, the eyeshadow brush, because this one is more pointy and thin. I feel like this will just be good to lightly put eyeshadow on my bottom line. So let's see. And again, there's no method to this either. I'm literally just dipping this into multiple brown shades and just putting it under my eye. So like, like this. And that's all I do. That's literally all I do for eyeshadow. I'm a simple woman. I don't do that much. I used to be really into makeup and like, 2015, 2016, that whole era of makeup gurus and having like a million different foundations and a million different blushes. I got sucked into that. But now I just want my things that I use every day to just do simple, fast, easy makeup. Because, and I still have some of that makeup from like 2015, 2016, those like big Morphe palettes. I have like two of those and I like never use them. So I'm like, that was wasted of money, <sighs> but it's okay. We we've learned and we've grown and we've just, you know, bettered ourselves. Um, but if you're just not joining, I'm like going on a rant. I just finished talking about this brush set from Brusheen. It comes with five brushes and I just used three of them on my face and then it comes in this beautiful kind of leathery packaging that's really good for traveling and then before that I talked about this like kind of like all-in-one product and I applied this on my cheeks for a blushy glow so that's why I'm so glowy and shimmery due to that product um but yeah, if you have any questions about those products that I already covered, feel free to ask. Um, but I'm going to get into the last product now. Oh, but before I forget, the brushes were originally $35, but if you get it with the 15% off, then they are $29.75. So there's that. Um, and then getting into the last product, which is going